Hello, sir. A warm good morning. I am Debra Pratabhakar, currently a pre-final year student in the Department of Mechanical Engineering from IIT Kharagpur, enrolled in its dual degree course of Manufacturing Science and Engineering. My area of interest is in machine learning and artificial intelligence. I started to learn about them during my second year. I initially started with online courses on Coursera from Professor Andrew Ng and some courses on Kaggle. I also took some courses in my college which are relevant to my research interests like programming and data structures, algorithms laboratory, machine learning foundations and applications and big data processing. All these courses helped me a lot in understanding the concepts of ML and also in the practical aspects of it. Data structures and algorithms got me familiar and comfortable with how to write code with good time complexity. In the course of machine learning, I learned the working behind many ML algorithms like logistic regression, naive base, k nearest neighbors, decision tree, XGBoost, and deep learning concepts like artificial neural networks, convolutional neural networks, and recurrent neural networks. In big data processing, I learned how to handle and process data when it is so large that it can't even fit our hard drive. From the courses on Andrew NG, I went more in depth into deep learning, especially on how to use pre-trained models for various tasks like object detection using the YOLO algorithm and face detection using Siamese networks. This semester, I have taken up the course on soft computing where I was introduced to various optimization techniques like genetic algorithms, fuzzy logic controllers and neural networks. After learning the fundamentals, I did a few self projects on Kaggle and interned at various companies to gain further experience. I worked on various projects like financial analytics and product recommendations. For doing machine learning related tasks, I mostly work on Python, where I work with various libraries like TensorFlow, Keras, Pandas, and Matplotlib. I've also worked with some pre-trained models like VGG16 and ResNet50, among many others. Apart from this, I have experience in development where I have used languages and frameworks like C++, JavaScript, Java, Node.js, Django, and front-end tools like HTML, CSS, and Bootstrap. Out of them, I am fluent in Python and C++. In my first year, I had taken engineering mathematics where I learned differential and integral calculus, linear algebra, and differential equations. In my second year, I took courses on transform calculus and partial differential equations. I have also done course on probability and statistics from Statistics 110 offered by Harvard University. I'm confident that all these things are highly relevant and will give me a head start in the project when I will be working under your guidance. Next, I would like to talk about my projects. My first research project was on wind turbine simulations where I had done numerical simulations using Python and finite element method simulations in ANSYS. These simulations were done to find optimal profile of the blades of the turbine for given atmospheric and wind conditions. This project was done under the guidance of Professor Aditya Bandopadhyay from Mechanical Department IIT KGP and Professor Sandeep Saha from Aerospace Department IIT KGP. Currently, I am working on a research project which involves optimization of velocity profiles of electric vehicles for minimum energy consumptions under the guidance of Professor Vikrant Rachella from Mechanical Department IIT Kharagpur. The idea behind the project is that a vehicle can travel between two stations having an infinite number of velocity profiles and we want to find the profile 
which has the least energy consumption various parameters like profile and slope of the road vehicles engine efficiency and capability were taken into consideration we also introduced a lot of constraints like charging stations in between the road battery life of the engine and minimum travel time this problem was solved using particle swarm optimization as the popularity of autonomous vehicles in increasing providing an optimal velocity profile will go a long way in reducing carbon emission and contribute to a greener environment in the past year i had worked with chefor which is an online e-grocery store there i had worked on the problem of cart prefilling and item recommendation so the idea was that whenever a customer logs in his cart would be prefilled with some items which the customer is highly likely to buy while grocery shopping a lot of items like vegetables sauce grooming items like soaps and shampoos are bought at regular intervals so by looking at the past buying pattern of the customer we had to predict the items which he would most likely buy in the current order after trying a lot of different algorithms i finally implemented xgboost for solving this problem this year i worked at two companies first one at kpmg where i was working on electricity demand forecast the government of india wanted electricity demand forecast for the next two decades in some cities in india we have a huge problem of power shortage and to tackle with that the government wanted to get the electricity demand so that it could plan out on reducing power shortage by installing more power plants and setting up more solar energy panels the second company where i worked was at ethan ai where i worked on dynamic risk profiling of clients we had the data of a lot of investors who invested in various kinds of financial instruments like fixed deposits and precious metals which are low risk assets shares and mutual funds which are medium risk assets and options and derivatives which are high risk assets so based on the past trading behavior of the client our task was to predict the risk profile of the client which would be fed into the markowitz model for generating his optimal portfolio we had implemented a deep learning neural network for it and also wrapped it up in an api finally we also built a django app so that it could be used from the front end i am confident that my academic background and experience in the field are highly relevant to the project i am applying for and i'm very motivated and excited to really understand the structures of deep neural networks and the mathematical foundations behind a thing that has been proving very helpful to solve a lot of problems for humanity i am also very motivated to pursue my masters degree from a top university in canada and this project will definitely help me a lot in doing so Thank you.